Lots of technologies used in your vehicle allow you to optimize your range by reducing your energy consumption. Battery capacity and vehicle driving range are closely related. The 40 kilowatt hour battery gives you a range of up to 186 miles or 300 kilometers WLTP. It is more suitable for a car that is rarely used for long journeys, so it won't need charging en route. The 60 kilowatt hour battery has a range of up to 270 miles or 450 kilometers WLTP or 167.4 miles or 270 kilometers for motorway driving. It provides more flexibility and allows longer journeys. In both cases, a weekly charge is enough to cover most uses. You don't need to recharge your battery every day. A charge of just 80% is recommended if you don't have to make long journeys. Remember, various factors affect the driving range of an electric vehicle including and mainly driving speed, driving style, and even the external temperature. For example, the range of an electric vehicle on the motorway in winter with the heating on can be half that of urban driving in the springtime. Several features have been provided to help you to deal with these factors and reduce your energy consumption. The information shown on your instrument panel will help you to adapt your driving to avoid high energy consumption. The power meter shows you the electrical power consumed by your vehicle in real time. It shows when energy is being recovered and when it is being consumed. It's easy to avoid going into the excessive consumption zone by taking your foot off the accelerator when you reach that zone. In addition, the driving style indicator informs you in real time about your driving style. The bigger the circle in the green zone, the better you're controlling your speed and acceleration and the better your anticipation. It shows that your driving is economical. Your vehicle is also equipped with four levels of regenerative braking. Select your level with the paddles fitted behind the steering wheel. Thanks to this feature, when you decelerate, the electric traction engine applies more or less resistance to the wheels, slowing you down and generating electricity to charge the battery. Depending on the driving conditions, you can choose the engine brake level that will regenerate the electricity for the battery. So it's easy for you to adopt a smooth driving style that anticipates decelerations without sudden braking. This efficient driving preserves the driving range and reduces wear to the brakes. The Eco Mode feature can be switched on to optimize your vehicle's energy consumption. It automatically controls the energy consumers, reducing their consumption to the minimum necessary. The heating and air conditioning are kept to the minimum necessary, while the speed is restricted to 62 miles per hour or 100 kilometers per hour. Your OpenR Link multimedia system provides lots of features that help to maintain your electric vehicle's range. In the navigation section, information on the map, such as traffic info and the location of charging stations, helps to make your journey easier. The multimedia system helps you to plan your journey by letting you know if the vehicle's current charge is enough to get you to your destination. If one or more charges are required, it automatically suggests the best combination of charging stations along the way to keep your total distance to the minimum.
What's more, this feature lets you condition your vehicle as you approach a charging point. The battery will then be at the ideal temperature for faster charging. The vehicle section has electric and eco-driving menus that will help you to optimize your vehicle's range. On the electric menu, select the energy tab to display the energy flow and your energy consumption over the previous 30 minutes. This helps you to manage your energy consumption better. You can use the charge and AC tab to schedule the charging and air conditioning of your vehicle. Preconditioning means that the passenger compartment will be at the right temperature when you set off. This takes hardly any energy from the battery while it is connected, plus it maintains the vehicle's range, as you use the heating and air conditioning less while you're driving. Lastly, go to the Battery tab to set the maximum charge for your vehicle's battery. In order to preserve your battery, we recommend that you set the maximum charge to 80% for day-to-day -day use of your vehicle. See the eco-driving menu for information on your journeys and energy saving. You'll also find a score there that rates your eco-driver behavior. There's also lots of advice on how to optimize your energy consumption.